Hello, everyone. My name is Yuko Tomizuka. I'm a global real estate investment advisor with 30 years of experience. I have evaluated so far more than 20,000 real estate uh, properties. I have been releasing some information which I found to be useful for non-Japanese investors to tap Japanese market. This is sort of the economic environment surrounding Japan, which means Taiwan's future, fortune telling of Miss Audrey Tan. In this May, a friend of mine, Miss Cameria, made an analysis on Mr. Xi Jinping, the head of China Republic, uh, the Republic of China. According to the so-called Asian Zodiac, she won't be able to pursue the both economic growth and the China Communist Party unification. It was a dilemma maintaining the economy, the system would crops while reinforcing top-down power. Further restriction may weaken the economy. I'm not sure how much of readers, how much of you may find this idea to be interesting. This time was my response request, Ms. Cameria made another analysis of Ms. Audrey Tan, the digital minister in Taiwan. Her futures and insights on her life are as follows, as very interesting. Five points I'd like to raise. Number one, selected elite. Number two, dramatic transformation. Number three, charismatic career. Number four, adaptability and flexibility like an idol. Number five, correspondence with given destiny. Let me start with number one, selected elite. In ancient China, there was an examination by which the emperor can screen elite officers. We call this exam casual in Chinese. This exam was very tough and only a few people were accepted as a high level officers who were allowed to stay close to the emperor. Audrey has such a destiny that allows her to climb up her business career in an extraordinary approach. Actually, she went to the Silicon Valley in the US, was involved in, uh, in Google as a management, came back to Taiwan and finally joined the cabinet. Her destiny looks exactly like the casual exam system. Number two, dramatic transformation. In her destiny, a distinct transition was found, which means actually she was transferred her gender and has been releasing messages at an Hiloim among those transgender social groups. She also moved places to leave. Also her core Alina from IT to politics, politics right now. The feature number three, charismatic career. Miss Tan has a quasi similar destiny as had Mr. John Lennon, you know, the Beatles. John transferred his true self several times and then finally achieved a goal, the great success as a musician. Miss Tam, sooner or later, demonstrates strong charisma, and such transition may be required by the area. Ailer. However, such charisma sometimes can be appeared as a, the high and the low cycle. Change as do many celebrities. Therefore, Miss Tam may have to be careful to maintain her core value as a leader and, uh, and her credo. Fast, fear, and fun. Number four, adaptability and flexibility like an idol. Idols sometimes demonstrate some flexibility towards the social mood and also show adaptability towards people's taste. Some of Japanese idol stars have followed the mainstream general trends in a society and flexibly changed themselves to be accepted by the audiences. Audrey's Asian horoscope shows such tendency and a good sense of survival under Bruka Eller. Number five, correspondence with given destiny. According to her Asian Zodiac ledger, early stage independence looks a key of, of success for her. She got independent in the US apart from her parents. And this can be taken as an action that support her own given destiny and enhance the energy provided by the universe. Therefore, Miss Tan's fortune will be very prominent unless she loses her core value. Acting for people as a high class officer, personally, I found her to be a very nice person and a good person. And therefore I would like 
to support her as a good next era digital minister. Thank you for your attention. If you like this video contents or this channel, please click like button. Thank you so much.